From World War II, there was a lot of destruction that occurred in Europe, Britain, and also world over. Countries then sat together. They had a core purpose then to rebuild the world, Europe being one of the most affected, and put international cooperation in managing global financial systems. So, Bretton Woods institutions, we can highlight them here, Examples, the examples that I'm um, to highlight include now the World Bank Group, the global uh, umbrella body, the World Bank Group. World Bank Group, we have seen the abbreviation there I can use. The second example is the International Monetary Fund. International. monetary fund commonly known as IMF. This specific body under the Bretton Woods Institution and the World Bank offers international monetary cooperation, ensures that our monetary policies around the member countries in the world, they are in cooperation, they are in coherence with each other. This coherence ensures that the international financial market do function properly. Another example is the International Bank for Reconstruction and Development. International, international Bank for Reconstruction. and development. Commonly abbreviated as IBRD. As we have seen, the major driving factor for the formation of Bretton Woods Institution was to rebuild Europe and rebuild those countries that were so much affected by uh, the aftermath of World War, uh, World War II. Therefore, the name International Bank for Reconstruction and Development, whose key agenda is to develop. And majorly, this occurs in Europe. International Finance Corporation. International. Finance Corporation, IFC. IFC, this concerns itself specifically with the economic environment encouraging trade and it touches on uh, putting those measures putting those policies that support trade through multinational uh, uh, organizations like multinational um, corporations, those for-profit organizations. The key concern about IFC is to ensure that there is uh, smooth trade that uh, MNCs uh, pursue with a profit agenda. Then the next is the International Development Association. International Development Association.
I D A. We have said one uh, goal of multilateral development banks is offering advice. Member countries who are uh, uh, under IDA, they receive uh, both uh, technical advice as regards to development projects they are going to pursue. Whether those projects are going to be uh, feasible for those economies, then IDAs offers that technical assistance to evaluate projects. There is the International Center for Settlement of Investment Disputes. International Center for Settlement of Investment Disputes. disputes, commonly abbreviated as ICSID. You agree with me, as with any human interaction, as with any human behavior, there will come a time that there will be disagreement, and this disagreement center on uh, investment, and we are talking of large investments, yeah, so countries can disagree. In order to settle those disagreements, then there is a specific body that assists member countries to uh, agree, amicably agree on the way forward, and that is the ICSID. There is also the Multilateral Investment Guarantee Agency. Multilateral Investment Guarantee. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to get yourself a copy of our professionally prepared study text and revision partners. Visit our shop along Tomboya Street, Pioneer House 3rd Floor, opposite Fire Station.